Never vlog, kids. Eventually you gotta stay up or you gotta wake up to edit. And you don't want none of that, because you could be... I'm just kidding, I really enjoy it. It's fun getting to play with soundtracks. It's fun seeing how you people react to my humble life. Or our humble lives. Mine and Justin's beautiful life we've built together. And this gorgeous little house. I just finished doing my laundry. And I was folding my clothes and I found this. Inside one of my pants. <laughs> I have no idea what this is. Oh, there we go. It's a Popeye's coupon or something. Sweet. It's another beautiful day in Sarasota. So we're gonna head to the beach. I'm gonna meet up with Datev, Corey, and Yuki. We're gonna go to Siesta Key. Wyatt might meet us there later. He's asleep right now because he was up all night editing. So thank him for that when you get the chance. Oh, I forgot the GoPro. No. Damn it. I have Dot on the phone right now. Wait for the camera. Ah, <laughs> ah <laughs> Look how long the line is for the parking lot at the beach. Every single weekend it's like this. And it goes all the way back. Well, we got one. It only took like five minutes, okay, so I'm pretty out. happy. Santa Claus! Go say hi to Santa Claus. Yeah. Go say hi. Oh, this water's cold. I heard he's a fake. I heard he's a fake too. He looks legit though. Let's get a close up. Christmas in April. Our friend Yuki just got here. So we're gonna go watch him skim. Right? Look for the man in the pink shorts. Say hi. Hi, bro. Check it out. <laughs> <laughs> nice shorts. A lot of people here. Not as many as the last time we were here. Remember when we were, when we were surfing, like, you could hear the dolphins yeah. in the water? Yeah. Okay. That was really cool. The guy's on a boat. This boat's about to get in trouble for being so close. That sand tower is taller than the girl that's constructing it. That lady has my headphones. Go Bows! Kids rad. Ah. Woo. <laughs> Sick. Sick. Isn't the beach so nice? What's that? <laughs> I feel like my is crazy. Is it? Traffic! We've all been here fighting with the boots. God! Why is this so difficult? Come on. Ah, there. Boots on. Sexy space, Mass Effect boots. Some people return to their alma mater to like, you know, go to various graduation ceremonies and reunions and things like that. I go because they're playing Homeward Bound in the TA. Uh, are you serious? Oh, what the hell? It's a walk.
This sucks. I was gonna, like, I have the GoPro and I wanted to ride around the bike, but the damn. <sighs> I think it's that thing. It's, I think it's a, there's a recall on the bike. It has to do with the circuit board. It kills the battery like every like week if I don't just perpetually charge it. And I went over to New York, I forgot to charge it, and now it's completely dead again. So I gotta go get a battery. Eh. I wanted to fly with you guys. I wanted to fly. A lot of you guys have said the beard has to go, so I'm gonna trim it a little bit. For you. There, I'm trimming it. Look, it's so trimmed. See some of that? Get some of that angle right there. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. There, I don't look nearly as barbarous now. Good for YouTube. It's amazing what a shower will do. I really ought to do it more. Sorry, you guys are gonna have to deal with the beard, the red beard, for a little bit longer. It's about two months ago, I decided I could finally grow one. And I've been wanting to like grow a little beard my whole life. And you know, keep in mind I'm 23. So about 23 is about the right time for I think the men in my family like to start getting their little ginger beards. And I got my little ginger beard, so I'm gonna wear it with honor for at least a while. And then I'll go clean baby shave again and get carded to go see rated R movies. Okay, they were supposed to be homeward bound here, <laughs> Ray. And now I got all in the Z amphitheater. Oh, I got all showered Can't for you nothing. Sit outside? <laughs> How even watch a movie outside? This is gonna be the most. This is gonna be terrible. Hey, it's in the Z amphitheater. I just assumed it would be somewhere good. Yes, I guess. If I hold this nine feet away, it'll be about the same size, I think. <laughs> In Alabama? Yeah. Is that because they haven't gotten DVD players there yet? Yes, Ray. Look at these speakers, though, in ratio to the television <laughs> size. They're not television. It's like, yeah. <laughs> Is gonna go on? No, I don't want to be on the vlog. You don't want to be on the vlog? Yeah, I'm different from everyone else. Did you, um... <laughs> I'll just edit your face out, yeah. <laughs> we have a blurry mass eating clementines. I like that shout out you gave me. I was gonna say, I shouted you out at Best Buy when I was like, I'm not doing whatever you said. Cajun fries. Yeah. Oh my god, I forgot about that. <laughs> College is just 20 somethings reminiscing about being five somethings. I really don't know what this is. Every time I come here, I find something really wonderful and interesting. It's cool. What do you think that is? Art. Yeah, it's art. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Everything is much more awesome when you graduate college. Holding out a job and things like that are just like, I don't know. At least in my mind, way better than just worrying about what some professor is going to think of your work. Isn't this pretty? Look at all the flowers. If you ever want something really surreal, if you're now, depending on who you are, if you're a college student or a graduate, respectively, you should go to back to your high school or your college and just walk around and pretend like you go there. It's really weird. I totally go here though, whatever. It smells like something's burning. This is our ATM machine. Okay, looks good, looks good, brand new, looks real good. Oh wait, look at we have uh, oh, application error. Win ATM.exe and counted a serious error and must shut down. <laughs> Why can't that just be spitting money? Oh, they brought the machine back. One thing that sucks about my house, no soda machine. Okay, I'm gonna teach you guys something that you didn't learn from me, okay? Now, these types of soda machines here, the ones where there's like a conveyor belt and then like a release of where it comes out. Okay, what you do on these is you take your arm and you shove it up here so that when the soda comes out and over and tries to get out, it's blocked, okay? If you do that, the machine will think that the soda like wasn't there, like it was in a depleted spot and then it'll give you credit for another one. But the soda will still be in the chamber. You could do that probably for about like two or three free ones, but after that, there'll be so many stacked up right here that the belt actually won't be able to lift up because it'll be so heavy, and the whole damn machine will break it and you'll get in trouble probably. Look, I'm in the Jedi Council room. Where's the green screen when you need it? To the bandages. Part four, Oral. The container is perfect to hold my Bible figurines, so I'll There's never no one here. Oh. 
Typical. Blaring TV, no one around. We're gonna walk home because Ricky doesn't have a car and I got dropped off here. <laughs> so, maybe you'll get to witness a stabbing. I must admit there's one thing I like about Sarasota. You can walk down three lane highways. There's no one here. Seriously, this is kind of weird. <laughs> Don't think about it. Pray about it. Her name is Sassy. And she's got a beard. She got a beard. The stupid cat from the thing tonight was named Sassy, which is a funny name for an animal. But here's two of them right here. I didn't, I couldn't believe when people were telling me it was named Sassy, and here I am greeted with another Sassy. I feel sassed. Want to know how nice Tammy Trail is? Right now we're hiding from a car that keeps circling around because they're propositioning us for sex. <laughs> this is why I love Sarasota. It's a van with some dude that keeps circling, so we just cut behind this building, cutting around because we don't want to see or have him see where we live. Look, it's the Siesta Inn, American owned. Thank you, visitors. A beer, how do you say that? A bierto? A bierto, that's really, it's a really weird mix of Spanish and English, especially to declare that you're American owned when it's called the Siesta Inn. Why is everything so weird on this road? <laughs> Currently locked out, because I didn't bring my keys, because I wasn't driving. So I guess we sleep out here tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Let's sleep in the garage. No, it's got it's got a chair and some lights. It's nice. <laughs> this could be quite homey. Ah, yeah. We could just sit right here. <laughs> you can go in the interview chair. Sit down. It's a squid. Where's your mind? Where's your mind? Everything's not about fallacies. Oh, yes, it is. Yeah, you're right, it is. Everything is about dicks. I forgot. <laughs> it's like cutting me. Well, the beach was good, but I'm exhausted. I feel like the sun just sucked the energy out of me. I feel like I got some sun. Oh. Oh. Definitely. Oh my god. My face is gonna be on fire in the morning. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta get up at like 8 in the morning to help my dad do an AC installation. So, good night. <laughs>